could not do any damage to the innate virtue of the three holy children in the furnace in Babylon, right? Right? Um, uh, captives, bondsmen, strangers, though they were in a foreign land. But the enemy's assault becomes to them rather an occasion of greater confidence. Because you know what they said to the king, Nebuchadnezzar? He said, oh, wise king, live forever. Right? But we will not bow down before the, the great idol that you have erected. Right? Whether our God saves us or whether he doesn't, know that we will not worship this idol. It made them even more bold. So what shall we be able to harm? Who, what shall I be able to harm the temperate man, the virtuous man? There is nothing, even should he have the whole world in arms against him. But someone may say, in this case, that God stood beside them and plucked them out of the flame. Certainly he did. And if you will play your part to the best of your power, the help of God, the help which God supplies will assuredly follow. Meaning that you will be just like those three holy youths in the flaming furnace. Right? There's Chrysostom. That's Chrysostom. If we have faith and if we repent from our sins, then nothing will hurt us. Nothing can hurt us, so to speak. God will protect us. Okay, any questions about Chrysostom? What time is it that clock is dying? Eight. Okay, so we have about ten more minutes. St. Chica the